food. To recap what we've learned so far, if you hire employees with personality disorders, have screwed up procedures, don't train your people, have low expectations, maintain a work environment that's toxic and ticks people off, chances are excellent that people aren't going to do their jobs. Instead, you want to be more like these guys. You recruit for character. Train heavily, placing emphasis on customer experience. Pay a little more. Have bosses that tell the truth. They're nice to the customers. They keep the place clean, especially the restrooms. They have a reduced complexity menu, which helps food consistency. All of this stuff is frequently audited. The operator acceptance is more difficult than getting into Harvard. Operators participate heavily in store profitability rather than in store sales. The result of all this? Well, this is the American Customer Service Institute index of whether customers like you. And here they are. And here is the Mickey D's. Corporate sales are 20% greater than KFC despite having one-fourth of the locations and being open only six days a week. Employee turnover is 55% of that of McDonald's. Employee turnover for management is less than 5%. And there are some side details that are important. One person's selectivity is another person's discrimination. So they spend a lot of time in front of this guy. Also, this company is privately held, as opposed to these guys who are publicly traded and corporate values are affected by this. So to summarize, be selective in hiring, train extensively, you'll have engaged employees and management, customers will like you, you'll make more money, and people will do their jobs.